Hi, my name is Nina Kavlashvili. I'm from Georgia and I'm a student of Quantitative Economics Master's program of the second year. And today I'm going to be answering some of the questions from different topics about my study, my program, the university and generally the Estonia. So let's get started. That's a good question. Uh, so I had a lot of recommendations uh, from my friends in Georgia, from my um, classmates and a lot of people who have gone through this path already. And because Tartu University has great opportunities for providing different kinds of scholarships for uh, people who are actually willing to learn. And besides that, uh, they have a lot of uh, fundings for the tuition waivers, so it's a great. I like everything in Tartu. I love this city. It is uh, amazing that it's a student city itself, like you can feel it everywhere. Uh, nevertheless, of the season that you can have any activities during the day or night, go partying, go canoe trip or during the winter you can ball the snowballs or anything like that. So I love the city itself and I would recommend to spend your studenthood here. Oh, well, I had the opportunity to take the language courses besides my mandatory ones and one of them was Estonian, obviously, because I'm in this country and it was really fun because a lot of the words don't make sense for me when I'm walking in the street and uh, it's helped me to avoid an, a lot of confusions and right now I decided to take Italian as well because it's just fun. I would say in my program uh, we had quite uh, a lot in the second year but most of the first year courses were individual work whilst you can collaborate on the individual works as well which is not mandatory but it doesn't mean like copy pasting the results but like program is open they are even um, encouraging you to support each other and to work in the groups and but you should submit the individual results the second year there were a couple of group events which is interesting because uh, you get to know to make people closer for me it was the traveling itself because before that i have not fly to any of the foreign countries and then I was going for uh, living to another country for two years so it was quite exciting and it is a different country completely different from Georgia uh, although we had some uh, common uh, national uh, understandings so but the weather is different a lot of things and I was quite uh, afraid in the beginning but in the end, I'm really happy that I have done this decision. So. Oh, I love them. I mean, they are not my fellow students only, they are my friends. And I'm lucky to say this. Uh, we have gone through a lot of challenges together. And the most exciting thing is that we have been together, assisting, helping throughout all the projects and uh, preparations for the exam but also we have been going out together a lot we had a lot of trips in Estonia outside of Estonia <laughs> so I hope that we will remain a good friends uh, for living it is enough especially in Tartu because you're mostly uh, integrating with uh, foreign students, but I would suggest anybody who is coming here more than one semester to learn Estonian because all the uh, shops or anywhere you go on the cafes you will like they speak English but if you want to read something on your own there are no uh, any 
notices in other language rather than Estonian, which is really good. I was really amazed with this, well, maybe annoyed in the beginning, but then I realized why are they doing this? They are protecting their language nevertheless that we are international students. If you want to leave Estonia, you need to learn at least the basic of the language. Question exactly for me. Okay, <laughs> so first year I was networking and I would also suggest people who are coming for the first year not to do that because it is really difficult in the beginning to catch up uh, with the studies and to get used to the system itself. But from the second year I had all the support from my uh, program manager and I had uh, full support also from the lecturers itself because they understand it is essential for us to gain some qualifications besides the studies because that's why we are learning to get some experience and implement our learnings in practice. Definitely, yes. I wasn't planning to stay here when I first applied for this program, but after uh, my opportunities of uh, career development that I have started the internship, uh, and right now I'm working in the Swipe Bank, uh, and this program gave me a lot to get what I uh, want and where I am right now, so I'm going to stay at least a couple of years so it means I also like the country itself. I would say like be open, uh, be open with the people and um, try to not limit yourself anyways because there are so many opportunities, so many uh, things that you can do and uh, also a lot of exchange programs, anything you would like, the learning um, programs and also entertaining ones. So try to be as open as you can and try to communicate a lot to get a lot of information from your fellow students or your uh, supervisors. So just take your chance.